Hello, it's Sophie going live day 206. I'm a busy mum building a business online and I'm recording my journey. I go live every day. I'm making the most of a little moment in the car today, waiting for one of my kids. Um, and I thought I'll, I'll quickly go live, share a little thing that happened to me today. And um, because I'm, I think it might be useful um, for you to to know this. Um, yesterday I got an Instagram message. I don't get many messages on Instagram, but I got this Instagram message from somebody who started following me who I have no idea who they are. And this message was was basically, hi, I'm so-and-so, I'm an affiliate for ClickFunnels, and um, guess what? <laughs> Russell Brunson is just at the moment giving away a book. Um, it's brilliant, but it might not last. It's free, it's free, but the offer won't last for very long. Grab it while you can, thank me later. Now, Honestly, <laughs> this absolutely, <laughs> completely annoys me and irritates me because this person who I, I have no idea who they are just basically sent me this message, which they're probably sending every everybody, um, lying really because I know that um, all Russell Brunson's books are free plus postage and it's not limited um, it's it's they're not just going to disappear soon um, not making any effort to see if if I might be interested if that's what I need or anything like that um, and I just thought, well, I know for sure that this is a person I'll never buy anything from straight away, okay? <laughs> Even if it's the nicest person on earth, this is really the way to go about putting me off buying. And again, it got me thinking what, what gets me to buy from people. When I've bought from people, it's generally because they've been helpful because they haven't tried to pressure me into buying anything, because they've listened to what I'm doing, because they've noticed me in a kind of way. They, they, th this person, for instance, I mean, I'm an affiliate for ClickFunnels, um, so I know, I know uh, about Russell Brunson's, uh, Brunson, I know about his great books, I know about the fact that it's free plus postage, I know that the, the offers are not limited. Uh, had this person asked a couple of questions, instantly she would have known that there's absolutely no point trying to sell me one of Russell Brunson's books, right? Um, but, but it was sort of, yeah, so, so it was this pitch straight away and I find this intensely irritating and so as I was saying I, I would buy from somebody who takes the time um, to, to yeah to, to show some interest in me somehow or in what in what I'm doing okay um, so you know think about that I, I mean we're all different and some it might this tactic technique might work with some people I don't know it does not work for me and my guess is it there's quite a few people who are like me and it doesn't work for them either um, so yeah I encourage people to think you know it's the same when I, I look at Facebook walls some, sometimes people's Facebook walls sometimes it's just a series of posts about what they're selling now, I'm not saying we can't advertise what we're selling ever. I mean, I do. I, I'm, I'm pleased with what I'm selling and I want people to know about it and I want to post about it. But if every single post is about this, I mean, I don't know. I, 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 it puts me off. I'm thinking, well, what value is this person giving to me? What, who is this person? Um, yeah, who are they? What are they doing? What are they passionate about? Um, so I think 
yeah, I think we all really have to think what what makes us buy, what makes us trust someone, and um, what makes us think that just by sending straight away a link to something, people are just going to say, oh, yeah, great, I'd better go and buy that. I mean, <laughs> um, you know, yeah, I, I think it's really important. And even though we all want to sell our th- our stuff, obviously, um, I think it's so important to care about people and not just to want to sell. Um, I want to make a difference to people. I want to sell stuff that's valuable, that's going to help them in one way or another, um, whether it's going to help them save time, make money, uh, reach their audience better, I don't know, learn, um, you know, there's all sorts of reasons um, for a product to be valuable. But I just, I don't just want to sell, sell, sell. I, I want, yeah, I want to help people out. I want to be useful. I want, I want the stuff that I sell to be valuable. Um, and, and, and if I want to sell the right stuff to the right people, I've got to know who the people are. Okay, that that's kind of basic. This woman, or this person, I don't even know if it was a woman actually, I'm thinking. <laughs> but anyway, <laughs> this person um, might have something else to sell that I might be interested in. But she, he or she should have, you know, asked, who, who am I? What are, what, yeah, what are my needs? you know, if I have any. So this is what I wanted to share today from my car on a rainy day. It's raining out there, you can't really see, but anyway. Um, If you like it, if you have any comments, any insights, anything you want to share, please do, by all means. I'm always really happy to have opinions and comments. Um, If you like it, like it. If you loved it, love it. And um, let me know if you caught the replay. I'll be back tomorrow for more. Bye for now.